Hey guys, I'm at a fancy restaurant today um, at the Palace of China, Hawthorne Dining. If you got an opportunity to come check out this restaurant, try out the new fall menu. So, um, you know what? Stay tuned and uh, we'll show you what this restaurant is all about. Okay, hey guys, so I'm here to actually give you guys my honest review of what it's like to dine at Hawthorne Dining at the Palliser Hotel here in Calgary. Now, here's the thing. As a quick disclaimer, I'm not a food journalist, I'm not a food blogger, I'm not a food reporter. I don't know how to write or talk about food. Like, my most basic way of telling you whether or not something is actually good is whether or not it's actually good or it's bad, right? According to my personal, uneducated opinion. But I can say this about Hawthorne Dining, is that if you're looking for a place that's a little bit more upscale, and if you want to go on a date with your boyfriend or girlfriend, maybe it's a special anniversary or whatever, it's a birthday, what I can say is that if you want to take them to a more upscale restaurant, I think this might be one of the places to go. It was actually a nice atmosphere, the staff was great, and most importantly, my honest review, the food was actually good because ever since I've I've gotten a chance to be in the media industry, ever, some places that I can tell you that it probably isn't that good because the things that we got we, we got to try was this we we had a chance to try out their fall appetizer menu all made with seasonal ingredients which is great and two of my favorite dishes was there there's an appetizer with albacore tuna in it one of my favorites um, it was funny because the gal was like oh what was your favorite I was like I don't know man I'm like the one with sashimi in it and they're like albacore tuna see in my mind because I eat so much sushi um, or shu sushi <laughs> Um, that I call everything sashimi, you know what I mean? Um, and then there was also, they use Wagyu beef and there's a Wagyu beef appetizer as well. But instead of using like um, um, your classic parts of the body, they use the cheeks. Yeah, man, you know what, at the end of the day, I would say that this place is actually good. Now, I realize that the majority of you, the majority of people will follow us, consumer content, and not in their 40s and 50s, um, that aren't going to fancy places like this on a regular basis and dropping bills, right? But I hope this helps, guys.